Hi, my name is Saptak Sen. I'm a product manager in the SQL Server team and I focus on big data. So, um, last month I went to two of the conferences. One was, first was Strata and uh, the other one was the Gartner BI Summit, both at sunny California. Um, and I got to speak with a lot of customers. And while talking with the customers, uh, one of the things that came up was around big data. So customers are getting deluged with data from all sorts of places. They, their web logs, they're collecting data from web logs, they're collecting data from sensors and so on. And, and because storage is cheap, they're, they're, they are storing all that data around. But they're asking us, okay, how can I create something meaningful out of this, something from which I can make some money, you know, at the end of the day, out of all this data I have access to. So that was interesting. And of course, there's a lot of buzz around Hadoop. So I asked during the conversation, how many of you are playing with Hadoop? So a couple of customers raised their hand and I asked, okay, how large is your cluster and so on. So he said, okay, I have a four node cluster that I'm playing with. So how long did it take you to stabilize that cluster? And um, he said, you know, it took me almost one and a half months to get it all right and, and to bring it at a state that I can start using it. Um, so, and, and I face the same thing. When I started off in the big data journey, I used to be in high performance computing. So I used to distributed infrastructure but when I set up my cluster it first with first few nodes it was extremely easy but as we went uh, forward uh, with all those configuration files and if one configuration files went out of sync the whole cluster broke and I didn't know how to you know where it went wrong of course there is no debugging um, because it's again a distributed infrastructure all tracing so I need uh, the tracing tools uh, to get insights from it and at the end of the day when I spoke to customers they say okay even if I have a Hadoop cluster I don't know how to kind of visualize that data how to create you know meaning from that data so in SQL Server uh, group that's what we are focused on in to make it easy for you know deployment configuration management and not just that to create insight from it. For example, one of the cool things we have is uh, we have integration from uh, some of the SQL Server 2012 features like Power Pivot and Power View to Hadoop. And Power Pivot and Power View are uh, great tools to uh, you know visualize that data, collaborate around that data very easily. With Power View, you can just do it from a browser. And, and when you add that power, or that uh, capability with Hadoop, it's it's awesome. By the way, there's a small uh, backstory about Hadoop if you didn't know. By the way, can you come with me? Here is the famous Hadoop elephant, and and uh, the story is that Doug Cutting, who created Hadoop, uh, his daughter had a soft toy and she called it Hadoop. So that's where this, uh, the name Hadoop comes from and this little elephant. So, uh, so if you have any questions uh, or if you want to know more, go visit uh, microsoft.com slash big data.